Hi, I'm Brian Roulette, Artistic Director of Roundhouse Theatre, and we're going inside four. I'm here with actress Holly Twyford. So, Holly, you're playing Afra Ben in the show. I am. Tell us a little bit about Afra. Uh, well, here's what's funny about Afra. Nobody really knows very much about her. So they know she was a poet and a playwright and a spy, and uh, that she, um, they know the plays that she wrote. They don't know a lot about her personal life or whether she was truly, in fact, married to Johann Ben, mm -hmm. and um, so it's it's really interesting. But clear, it's obvious that that Liz did a lot. The playwright did a lot of research. Did about you know her. much about her before this? I didn't this? know anything about her. So that's got to be interesting, just to be able to go dig into it and learn all about it. And it, process it, it. Really fun, really fun. And so, you are arguably one of DC's best actors. You, you're one of our, the most celebrated actors for sure. Which means that you one can, of the luckiest. It, actors, well, but it means you have, you're at a point in your career where you have choices about what you decide to do. Mm -hmm. What drew you to this play? When Aaron shows me a play, I take it seriously because I respect his his artistic views so much and so and you know the idea of working with him is always something I love I always you know I always learn from him he makes me a better actor and so so that's really what it was and then when I read it it's sadly very timely even though Afro was in the 1660s mm -hmm. about you know what choices women have and what they had then and what they have now or do they really and you know um, women artists, you know, we're, we're uh, Lynn Nottage and Paula Vogel have plays on Broadway for the first time ever, right. and they're both Pulitzer Prize winning right. playwrights, and it's it's been quite Shameful. a few years since 1668. Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> so it's I, I think it's great. I think yeah. it's very timely and very smart. Yeah. Well, Or starts performances April 12th. Come check us out.